normal corn. No, you can feel the difference. See? Oh, sorry. Yeah. And it's really sensitive. The memory of my whole feet is sensitive. Still, you are doing a really great job. This is very hard because any little awkward pressure it hurts you so much. It's so much pain. You have to walk like that, right? Yes, I can't put my feet oh. properly. And that's what really makes sometimes the corns worse, right? Yeah. Because then you put corn pressure in other places and that's what really hurts your foot. Do you mind rolling up the pant like just a little bit just to see the change in your sure, skin? Sure, sure, oh. sure. And you can see the difference that is between a, the Yeah, two. the left is uh, worse. Yeah. It is the worst condition of my... And that's how you walk with the foot like yeah, that? Yeah, I can't... Uh, yeah. Oh, okay, take a seat. Okay, let's take down these corns. That's so bad. But that's horrible. Yeah. So these corns have been changing over the years. Yeah, and uh, it's really terrible. You know, when I put my feet, I feel there is a nail because you can't clean it properly now. No, before I can go all the way to the bottom. Yeah. But this corn has changed yeah it's become more like a scar there's scar tissue that has filled inside and it's so sensitive that i can't scrape it yeah i can understand but what you are doing you are doing really great job oh, i need to say because you. Uh, uh, you know it was uh, yeah i know it's very difficult for you to do this but uh, still i can stand so Although I feel it's I'm um, standing on the nails, but uh, I can stand. You are still doing really good job. Oh uh, well, I wish we could do more, but this again, what really has happened? Something has happened with your circulation, right? Yeah. You know. Yes. Yes. The nerves are super sensitive in your exactly. foot now. Exactly, and the, the color yeah. change in the skin. Yeah, and the neurologist told me that too. That uh, I don't have, although I don't have. Uh, any nerve problem yep. but uh, no no problem but the yeah. vascular surgeon really yeah. said nothing yeah. much right because of the pressure of the blood vessels the nerve is getting dry and mm. uh, yeah so and that's what's changing everything yeah. so this corn used to be very easy like a normal corn for me to cut out now it's like a scar yes there's like a little fluffy part inside it's hard for you to see but there's like a little edge now that's very that's like a scar like i said it's not like normal dead skin i can't cut it out so i have to be always very careful yeah because of um, yeah it's not anymore uh, so normal corn no you can feel the difference see oh sorry yeah. and it's really sensitive the memory of my whole feet is sensitive still you are doing a really great job this is very hard because any little awkward pressure it hurts you so much. Yeah. But then you help my skills get better. <laughs> this is a tough one, so it makes me better and better and better. <laughs> so you're helping me. I wish I could clean this out more. I don't know, but I, yeah, I'm really, I don't know what I should do if I wouldn't come to you and uh, yeah. See, I can see the little part where there's a little sharp, almost like scar tissue. Sorry if this hurts. But just trying to get as close we can to that little yeah that i don't get problem later you have to know you want to do good yeah sometimes it bleeds a little bit if you just touch it yeah you're doing awesome thank you oh you're being you're being you're being tough with the camera on.
No, but we're going to get lots of it out like we always do. But how long does it give you relief for? How many days? Oh, sorry. How many days does it feel better before it starts to really come back? You know, almost four weeks, I have to say, because I come every, every six, six weeks. Yeah. So uh, till four weeks, it's okay. And then um, after four weeks, I feel that uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's difficult because uh, I get the pain. And uh, also that when I'm walking or standing, but uh, four, till four weeks, it's okay, actually. Or it maybe that uh, I got used to in between because uh, it's also a long time now. Yeah, and it's just been getting worse. Yes, it's getting worse and worse. But the vascular surgeon didn't suggest any sort of surgery or anything, right? No, they they told that it's not only one vein because I have the problem uh, blood circulation to the vein and so they are saying it's not one vein, it's uh, several veins it happens. And so did they just say there's nothing they can do or what did they? Yeah, they suggested me that uh, only to wear the stockings. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and then that's it, that it will give some certain pressure on the blood vessels and then that's it. And that's it. Yeah. And then they suggested me that uh, also, so it's better that uh, I don't do too much and I put my feet up. I know, but that is also not possible. It is not my possible. My lifestyle is not like this. <laughs> That's the problem with foot pain. We have to keep walking. We have to keep working. Yeah. So the feet never really get a break. Exactly. And with those kids always being hungry. Exactly. You're always they are standing. Hungry. Yeah. They are hungry. They bother me too much. But that's what kids, that's what kids do, unfortunately. <laughs> kids sometimes bother. Just wait till they grow up. They're gonna they're gonna learn. They're gonna remember when they're kids. Until the day they will grow up, I will most likely die. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. oh, you're funny. I know you're tired. It's a lot to deal with that all the time. Yeah, and uh, now that. Uh, the new thing is that their attitude also, because they are going, they are teenage, one is already teenage, another is going to teenage. So, their attitude, their, how they are speaking, that is also, you know. And remember, they're not, they're not Indian kids anymore. No, they are not. <laughs> they are not at all. They're not typical Indian kids, oh? No, 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 no. they are not at all. They are, yeah. They're, they're, they're Canadian. They are proud Canadian. They're proud. <laughs> they, are, they are saying, oh, we are proud Canadian. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I can't believe when you took them to India, they're just looking for burgers and pizza. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. And the, these things in India is very costly. You know, it's very expensive. And I'm feeling embarrassed also that when they are going to my friend's house or to uh, relative's house, they are saying that we want to eat that. And that's the most expensive stuff. Yeah. So they, they, they don't eat... Uh, they, they are saying we eat pizza, we eat uh, <laughs> burger, and these things are very expensive in India. Kids. And they don't want to go back, huh? No. No. Yeah. Different generation. Yeah, it's, you know what, games are really addicting. Oh my God, it, it, you can't believe. Oh, I believe because this corn, I used to play a lot of video games. 
but even during the first quarantine, I started playing video games and then I was wasting all my time. And I was like, holy cow, I need to stop. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to ground myself. <laughs> But see, at least you understood I, that I understood <laughs> that is good thing. You understood that this is an addiction. Because you know what? But I, I'll tell you, it's a lot of fun. But because it's you're not doing anything, it's easy, yeah. and you can waste so much time. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Recently, my son was telling me that uh, Fortnite or whatever I did. Yeah. Know. And I couldn't understand him. He told me that, oh, mommy, leave it. You don't understand. You don't know. You are too old. And your generation, they don't know about anything. So forget it. Yeah. And now with them being home so much, oh, my, I don't know how they can concentrate on anything. Yeah. I wouldn't be able to, honestly. So you, you, yeah, you have to have a lot of self-control. A, like a different world for the kids. Yeah, exactly. But India, how hard is school down there? In India, it's also online classes are going on that they are not going. And then you know that um, also I have seen that lots of, you know, the students, they couldn't uh, afford laptop, Wi-Fi. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But it's unbelievable, no matter how much rest, even if you don't walk, you wear the orthotics. Yes. You come back six weeks, no matter how much I take, it all comes back. Yeah, yeah. And hard skin is painful. It's very painful. I know. I, I really feel for you. Very painful. Each and every step I can feel. So. But the orthotic did make a difference, right? Yeah. Oh, it's. I have to say because of my work is I have to stand. Mm -hmm. So, you know, before when I didn't wear the orthotics, didn't use it, it was impossible. After an hour, I was feeling that. Uh, I can't stand anymore. It was so painful. And orthotics, I can stand even, you know, without break sometimes because when it's very busy. So I have to, yeah, I don't get break. So even six hours I can stand. I know it makes a big difference. Yeah. So that's why I think it's what you said maybe two years since your last one, right? Yes. I'll take a new scan today. Okay. And then you let me know if you have the coverage to go through it for this year or we wait for next year. Because again, we need to ref get you a new one. Yeah, yeah, sure. So, um, no, actually, he's waiting uh, downstairs, so he will come and he will. Okay, I'll take the scan anyways. Yeah, sure. That way we'll have it. It'll be good for the next two, three, four months. It'll be fine. This one doesn't bug you too much, does it? It's it's okay. Actually, you know this, that I, I don't feel too much that it's the, so painful. It's like this hurt. This one is uh, worse, but still, like compared to this one, it still it's painful. It is. It, it is still yeah, painful. Yeah, but compared with the other one, it's okay. Yeah. And luckily, there's no, like I said, scar tissue that's building up on this one yeah, like that other one. Yeah, thank God. Thank God. I hope that it will... Not change. Yeah, not change much. 
Because uh, I'm bleeding all the time, that's why stockings. All the time you're wearing them? Yeah, all the time. Well, how many years have you been coming in now? I think I started here coming 2013 or Wow. 2013. Long yeah. time. Long time, yeah. When I was just starting? Yes, exactly. And I had a little bit more hair. <laughs> 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 and here we are today. <laughs> you can see how the, the office has changed a lot. Yeah. More people working, not by myself exactly. anymore. I used to do everything by exactly. myself. Exactly, yeah. Before you used to, to work alone. Yes. Take all the payment, answer the phone. Yeah. But I don't see any changes to you. To me? No. Beside the hair. <laughs> <laughs> I've always shaved my head, so yeah. That's good to know. <laughs> you, th you don't look any, you look the same after all these years. <laughs> and that's why there's no way you're seeing anybody else, huh? Yeah. Because now there's, there's four of us now in this office. Did you know that? Four? Yeah. Oh. Four days of the week, there's three foot specialists working. Really? Really. Oh, nice. You have also other people here working yeah. with you. Nice. That's okay. That's okay. But they're all good. I know they are all good. But uh, you... Do you remember Julie? Who worked at front desk on Saturdays? Yes. Indian girl. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's all finished school now. Oh, so she's nice. working here. Yeah. Very nice. And she's good. She has a lot of, um, she's very good with the corns, just like me. No, really, she's good. But you know better. For so many years, I'm coming to you, and then, uh, yeah, my leg was up, down, in between. Oh. I went to several doctors' hospitals, and uh, this time you did also that uh, I had very bad sensitive. <laughs> yeah, it was, oh. So that's why uh, I'm really, you know, I don't want to go anywhere. <laughs> that's fine. I'm here. Yeah. So I, I'm really... I... What's going to happen when I retire? <laughs> <laughs> What are you waiting to do? Well, then you can see Julie. <laughs> <laughs> well, you were very sweet to bring me the, the Christmas present. That You didn't have to do anything. That was very, very nice. Look yeah. at that. You're going to make me nice and fat. No, that is nothing. So. That's very, very sweet of you. Thank you. You're most welcome. So I have to say thank, <laughs> thank you to you. Because uh, otherwise, you know that uh, this lockdown, almost two and a half months, I didn't oh, come. Yes. I couldn't come, and I was really thinking that what what I'm going to do, I couldn't work. And yeah, that was uh, really you that you told me, okay, I could come, and so well, I yeah, don't see, forget that you were the emergency case, right? Yeah, so, so I, I couldn't work. I, I, it was I was crying almost uh, at home, and that's why my husband. Uh, has taken contact with you yes, that it yeah. was impossible for me okay so we're gonna take down the nails take the scan and then you'll we'll do that'll be it for the video but at least i'll take care of the nails after this okay but no i really appreciate you letting me share the feet because again this is unbelievable how many years you've been dealing with this much pain yes i know you're very yeah. tough i feel for you quite a bit so i'm yeah. very happy you come i in. don't know the exact year but it's uh, i think it's 2013. yeah but i'm very happy because at least yeah. we can keep you you feel better right at least after this yeah yeah exactly if, i can walk properly if you didn't have this you wouldn't be able to walk well no 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 no, no not at all that's yeah. why for so many years i'm coming here yeah.